Hey, it's Marcus with another Vaadin Quick Tip video. I want to give you a sneak peek of the new Vaadin Studio plugin for VS Code, which allows you to live preview code as you type it. It's pretty cool. Uh, like I said, it's still a preview, so it's alpha level software. It's not something that you might want to use for everything that you do, but at the same time, it's really cool to get your hands dirty and start trying this new plugin out. So let me show you how you can use it in just three simple steps. So first of all, you need a Vaadin Fusion project. So I'm on start.vaadin.com here. And what you want to make sure is that here for UI technology, you select Fusion. It's going to be on Vaadin 19 today. I'm going to use Java 11 because that's what I have on my system. And I'm going to download the application. Once that downloads, I want to unzip this file. And I'm actually going to go into my terminal here. I'm going to CD into the new uh, folder check it out. It's a Maven project that I'm going to open up with VS Code. All right, so now that we have uh, the project open, next step is to go and install Vaadin Studio. So we'll search for Vaadin in the extensions marketplace and install it. All right, and you can see that it's installed now, which will allow us to go into the views here. And we're going to just take the Hello World view here. And the way you open up the live preview is by using this uh, command palette here. So you can get it here uh, from the view menu or using the shortcut. So on Mac, that's command shift P. On Windows, it's probably control uh, shift P. In here, you can type in Vaadin and select the open live view option here. I'll hide the sidebar because that's not something we need. The first time this runs, it'll take a little while as it's installing a whole bunch of stuff. So let's let that run for for a minute there and, and we should be ready to start editing some stuff. All right, so there we are. I'm gonna close the uh, terminal there and now you can see that I'm able to click on elements here and select some code and likewise I can go into code and I can start changing this around. So say, hello. So this now allows you to just live edit the template and instantaneously see the changes so you could just start building a view like, hello world. Let's make a form div here with button text field. We'll give those labels, field number, create four of those. You can see they show up here. I can click on one to select the one in code. Let's give this a custom one, custom. All right, and then let's simulate a row of buttons here. And here we'll have Vaadin button. And let's give these a theme. And we'll create two of these. So the first one will have a primary theme, say save. Second one will be tertiary. And this one will say cancel, like that. So there you have it, uh, just a very quick way of live previewing things, you can go both ways. So you can click on things in the template to select the right element in the code. And likewise, you can instantaneously change stuff in the code and see that visual uh, result here on the side. Then finally, the most important thing perhaps is be sure to give us some feedback. So go to github.com slash studio and file issues if you run into any bugs and hit us up on our Discord there's a studio channel where you can chat with other uh, people in the Vaadin community and with the team working on studio. So let us know what you think. Let us know what features you'd like to see here because that's going to determine what we're going to be working on next in studio. So check it out and let us know what you think. Thanks for watching. Bye.